All right, y'all. So today I am coming to y'all with another vlog video. Uh, I dropped my first one, The Day in the Life of Chris. But I felt like that was more like a rap video because I rap majority of the time. So when I went back and I looked at it and thought about it, I'm like, it's like a rap promotion. And then recently I released the hair video. So now we're back here. So I know you're wondering, well, what are you going to do this time? And that I don't know. I don't have this scripted. So I just said, I'm going to grab the camera and then I'm going to run some errands and I'm going to just record. I'm going to do that. So, I mean, it's kind of like day in the life of Chris part two, but not really. It's more like running errands with Chris. So that's what we're going to do. And we finna head out. Let go. All right, y'all. I'm getting ready to head out the house. Just going to show y'all the fit for the day. Got the red sweat on, you know what I'm saying? Then got the... The great Air Max is on what I'm working with today. It's gonna be the shoes I'm doing my walking in. And uh, on that note, let go. camera man we in action all right just got in the car now y'all can't tell but it is a very good day outside it feel really good outside hold up what, what's the temperature looking like i mean i feel good let me see 50 50 degrees but i mean it looks amazing so now the first stop we're going to smoothie king I can't even lie to y'all. Vlogging by yourself on your own, well, especially with this big camera, man, it's hard to do, but I just made it to, um, what is this? Smoothie King. Hi, welcome to Smoothie King. May I take your order? Uh, one moment, please. Let me see. You order when you're ready. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. Go ahead. Can I get the uh, 32 ounce Peanut Power Plus? What's that? Um, 32 ounce. 32 ounce, 25 strawberry, if y'all. Yeah, that'll be all. It'd be 829. All right. I'm gonna need a stack. Wobble that wobble that wobble. I'm gonna need a stack. Wobble that wobble that wobble. About to get this uh, smoothie cane. This smoothie from Smoothie Cane. <laughs> smoothie Cane. Y'all, this right here, when I leave the gym, this the gains. The gains. Now check this out. Today is Thursday, but I usually go every Friday. And then on Friday, it's like a $5 deal. I forgot. But I think this one was $8, but on Friday, it's $6. Only, well, $6 if you get in uh, um, a meal replacement one. But if you just get a regular one, a regular uh, smoothie then it's five dollars but yeah I, I had to get in there a day early now we um I don't know where we going now but uh we finna drive <laughs> all right y'all so my next stop was the Nike clearance store about to get in here and see what I can find I'm also kind of Christmas shopping. Well, not kind of, I am. But uh, before I go in there, I gotta tell y'all a quick story because uh, there's a dude that's always here majority of the time and he sells stuff out of his trunk of his truck. So he usually sell like cologne, uh, some charges and some other stuff like that. Why you gonna park right beside me? You know what I'm saying? Why you gonna park right beside me? I'm from my window up. But uh, what I was saying was that, uh, yeah, he sell like cologne and stuff out of his trunk. So one day I went over there, he was like, uh, come smell this, you know. He said, you ain't gotta buy nothing, it's free to smell. So I said, all right, cool, you know. So I went over there, you know, he said he had Versace, Gucci, Cologne. I'm like, you know, I smelled the stuff, it smelled good, it smelled real good. 
And uh, so he gave me a deal on it. I think it was like he wanted like uh, maybe two for 30 or something like that. I only had a 20 on me. So, uh, you know, I gave him $20 for two of them. So like $10 a bottle. And, you know, he was telling me, he was like, uh, yeah, this just came out the store. And the store that's like $60, $100 and stuff like that. I'm like, all right, cool, you know. So, you know, I, I get it. Then um, I get home and I look at the Versace one. The Versace logo, I know what the Versace logo looked like. It looked okay on the box, but I didn't really pay attention. I got home, I was like, man, this Versace logo don't even look right. I was like, hold up, wait a minute. And I don't even think you pronounce it Versace. I think it's Versace, the, the bottle he gave me. And then also, I know what a Gucci logo looks like. Like a lot of people know what a Gucci, look like. Gucci logo look like. Yo, why people keep parking beside me? But you know, a majority of people know what a Gucci logo looked like, and I know what it looked like. But he was just showing me this stuff, and I wasn't even paying attention. And then when he pulled the the Gucci cologne out of the box, I was like, Gucci wouldn't, you know, put the logo on there like that. It don't, it don't even look good. It looked like kind of undone. But you know, I went ahead and uh, I bought it. But yeah, so when I got home, even the Gucci logo, I'm like, hold on, this ain't Gucci logo. These ain't double G's. They double C's. It's Gucci. <laughs> so I was like, man, I got ripped off. Man, I heard hustling telling people he, he got this stuff from like uh, Mace telling us the prices at Macy's or JCPenney and stuff like that. Man, this stuff knock off. This stuff smell good. I ain't gonna lie, but like it's kind of weird because I, I don't even wear this stuff. But um, I did spray the Versace one time. Man, that stuff stay on you for days. I'm like, is this even healthy for my skin? I'm talking about days. But. That's one story. Second story over here. Somebody sold me a chain. He said he got it from, um, where he say he get it from? I don't know. He said he got it from a jewelry store, a, a very popular jewelry store that we all know. I just can't think of right now. So he's like, this real gold. It had a tag on it and stuff like that. And then um, on the tag, it said that it was about like, it was like a thousand, something like that. So I'm like, all right, cool. I'm like, how much you want for it? At first he said like a hundred dollars. I was like, man, I ain't getting no hundred dollars for that chain. And then uh, he was like, all right, 80. I'm like, man, nah. Uh, it was like, you give me $20, $20 in. I'm like, shoot, all right, $20 for the chain. And then it says about $1,000. I'm like, man, I got a real chain. Like, you know, $20 for a $1,000 chain. Like, why not? Man, I started wearing that chain. Over time, that chain went from gold to silver. I was like, man, this man got me. So every time I go to Nike clearance store, look, in Memphis, Tennessee, you go to Nike clearance store, and somebody's selling you something for the low, man, don't buy that. Don't buy that crap. This stuff ain't real. It's knockoff. I don't care what they say. It ain't real, man. They really convinced me. And I don't buy stuff like that. But on these folks, I only wasted like $40, $45. So I'm cool. But I was like, I, I wouldn't do it again, man. My chain went from gold to silver. Then over time, I was like, well, maybe it's gold and silver, you know, combined. And I was like, man, nah, the chain was full gold when I got it. But yeah, that's just, I just had to tell y'all this story. But I'm about to go on here to the store right now. I'll be back. I'm gonna say, probably gonna try to get me to go over there again. Uh, I'm okay. All right. They tried to get me. <laughs> she said she got a special buy one, get one free. I told us I'm right there, fake stuff. I'm like, I'm good. All right. All right, so I'm getting ready to leave the Nike clearance store. They didn't have anything that I liked. Plus, there's a lot of people in there. I'm just assuming that they were Christmas shopping. So I'm about to go on to the next location. Now, I know y'all can't see from this angle, but I just made it to the Tanga Outlet Mall in Mississippi. In Mississippi. So, people look at you crazy when you do stuff like this. It's like, mind your business. Ain't nobody worry about you, what you doing.
well, as you can see, I came back empty handed. Didn't find anything in there worth getting. So, um, about to move on to the next location. As of now, Christmas shopping is a fail. But on a good note, I lost my keys, but my keys were stuck in the car and my door was unlocked. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so I just made it to Marshall's. About to go in here, see what I can find. And then after I leave here, I'm gonna head over to Burlington. Now I would take y'all in, but I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I haven't built up that confidence yet. But I promise we getting there. We getting there, okay? I'm gonna take y'all in there with me one of these days. You know, it's like, you can't record in here. Man, I, I, I do what I want. If my camera I ain't recording y'all, so shoot. But yeah, I'll be back. Okay, I don't have my camera, but from my phone. So, let's go. Man, I've been out all day. I haven't bought not one Christmas gift, but we're about to head to Burlington. See what they have. But uh, it's not looking too good right now. <laughs> I'm back. Look, Christmas shopping is done. Still got money to spend, baby. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm done. Success. I got everything out of two stores. Hold on, I'm missing some dollars. Wait a minute now. You make it rain and you pick it back up as fast as you can. But uh, that's not the end of my day. About to run to uh, Guitar Center and uh, go look at some things over there. Yup. As far as Christmas shopping goes, it's a success in less than 24 hours. So, I'll see y'all soon. All right, so I made my final stop for the night, which is Guitar Center. I'm about to go in here. I might buy something, might not. Go play, play on the instruments a little bit. And my camera's dying, so any more footage from now will be from my phone. I don't know why my camera's dying. I mean, I've been on it, but I mean, the battery was fully charged, but yeah. beats but it's not working <laughs> fail fail for real bro like what
So my camera hasn't died completely. So I'm using it right now. But uh, I'm leaving Guitar Center. About to head to Kroger uh, to give me something to eat. And then uh, head home. But yo, I was in uh, Guitar Center trying to make a beat. And this dude walks in. And he was like, what's going on, man? I'm like, what's up? And then he was like, what you got going on in there? I was like, man, I don't know what I'm doing. He said, all right, I got you. I'm finna teach you everything. Man, look. He hooked up his machine he had in his backpack. Fire. I'm talking about he just made something fire. I'm like, dang, you know, shoot. I said, man, I'm trying to get like that. I needed a little light in here, so I'm using my phone. But y'all, I'm so tired. I have finally made it to Kroger. About to go in here, get what I need, then I'm going straight to the house. I'm exhausted. To everybody watching, we have finally made it to the end of the video. I didn't record when I made it home yesterday because I passed out. I mean, I went to sleep. As soon as I got home, I went to sleep. But on a good note, we beat the Christmas rush. At least I think I did. So, Christmas shopping is done. Um, all that good stuff. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I'll make another one. I don't know how soon, but soon enough. But as always, 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 remember to follow me on my social media. My Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, I shoot, even my Facebook, all that's going to be on this screen somewhere. I don't know yet. I ain't edited the video yet. But make sure y'all do that. Like I said, I hope y'all enjoyed. Tune in. There'll be more coming soon. It's Chris Sounds, and I'm out.